Hi guys, welcome to Kiki TV. I'm shooting in my home this week because we're in the middle of trying to contain the coronavirus pandemic. As I always say, mind, body, heart, and spirit are all connected, which means that if you can lower your stress, if you can lower your fear, if you can raise your joy, this all affects your immune system positively. Daily practice of meditation, it will go a long way to keeping you healthy. I'm gonna give you a very simple way that you can meditate every day that will most certainly help you to feel better, help to keep you calm in the middle of this storm. Ready? Let's talk about meditation. Meditation is very simple. It is a long-term concentrated focus on nothing. So you're gonna clear your mind and you're gonna put your feet flat on the ground and you're gonna sit up in a chair with your back straight. A lot of times if you try to meditate when you're in bed, you're gonna fall asleep. So sit up. This is an active practice of concentrated focus. What you're gonna do is you're gonna think of nothing and focus on your breath for five minutes. And it's as simple as that. Then when things come into your mind, which they absolutely will, oh my gosh, the news said, oh my gosh, is my mom okay? I wonder how my friend is. All these things, you gently and non-judgmentally push those out of your mind and you go back to focusing on your breath with a clear mind. And then more things will come in. The mind is always busy. It is creating stress and fear. And it's like, ah! that is why the Buddhists call it the monkey mind. But you have the power to control it, which is what you're doing when you're meditating. You can add in a prayer if you want for whatever religion that you are. You want to do a gratitude list before or after. You want to keep a pen and a paper by you, write down the wisdom that comes through. You could do it any way that you want it. Make it your own so like you really love it, you know, so that you want to do it. In the middle of the day, in this kind of worldwide crisis, you can stop and reconnect to your inner self. It's just peace. It's, it's peace. And, and the main thing that we're trying to do here is get you to relax, get your nervous system to calm down, get you to fill your heart and your soul with peace because that is how you get through a storm. You don't get through a storm by being all Bleh! You wanna get through a crisis with grace and with ease and with peace and thinking of other people and thinking outside of yourself. Five minutes. You cannot do it wrong. It is not easy. That's why not everyone meditates. It is very difficult to sit and face your own emotions and face your own thoughts and face your own fears. Unconscious people, they have a thought, they act on it. They have a thought, they react. They have anger, they go crazy. They have sadness, they, you know, fall apart. What you learn from meditation is that you can actually control your mind. A conscious person can say, well, I'm feeling this, but is this real, right? And let me see if I can gently and non-judgmentally push it out and go back to who I am, which is your soul, right? Your spirit, your higher self, there's many names for it. But that is the thing that's watching your mind. So that saying that says, I think, therefore I am, wrong. It's, I can watch my thinking, therefore I am. And I can change my thoughts and I can be different. I do not have to react to my monkey mind, right? If that is the case, you can control your anxiety and you can control your fear and you can control your sadness and you can control whatever thought you have because you are choosing your thoughts and it is a practice like building a muscle. You wanna hear the coolest thing? What starts happening once you hit like your stride in meditation, higher power or universe or God, whatever you believe that higher wisdom is, it starts coming through. I often meditate with like a pad next to me and write things down because the wisdom that comes through is so awesome and so clearly beyond me because you are connecting to your own higher self and then your higher power when you're sitting quiet and you're focusing on your breath and you are focusing on clearing your mind. Every day, five minutes in the morning and five minutes at night, you're going to sit with your feet flat on the floor, your back straight, you're gonna clear your mind, you're gonna focus on your breath for five minutes. And if you have a thought or a fear 
or an anxiety or some sadness or a memory or whatever it is, what are you gonna do? Let's all say it together. You're gonna gently and non-judgmentally push those thoughts out and just go back to your breath and a clear mind. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. We're all gonna be fine because why? We can heal.